Hello, universe. Welcome Hello. to the next part of Phoenix Wright, Ace Attorney. We are on episode three, Turnabout Samurai. We're going to be doing day the day one investigation. Um, might be split into two parts according to Mayo, but we'll see. So, so let's. It's uh, not let's... a super long investigation. We just need to slow down a little bit after <laughs> Turnabout Sisters went by so fast. Yeah. Uh, Gra, you have just the last time Steel Samurai. Bill Moon Sky cries for your blood. I don't even know who's voicing that. It's, it's fine. It was just like a one off for the opening. The moon! The moon. No! It. it is you! <laughs> it will be Casey Gabbana for it. It will be the last one they will ever see! <laughs> so, Power Rangers. Gra! <laughs> so Gra! The warrior sword gleams and strike of the night, oh, and that's fallen, but who? Only the moon knows! Oh, don't miss next week's exciting episode! The Dark Messenger returns! October 14th, 5.31pm, Rights and Co. Law Offices. I'm not gonna get used to that name. Hurrah! <laughs> See you in hell! Evil magistrate. Whoa! Stop waving that broom around. She's not. She doesn't have a broom in her hand. I was like, I want to see the spray with her with a broom, <laughs> just being waved around like a sword. Oh, Nick, I didn't know you were here. God, she's such a like ten-year-old. Of course, I'm here. I mean, she's still a teenager. <laughs> what was that surreal show you were watching? What? Nick, you mean you don't know the Steel Samurai? I don't know, but he looks pretty cool. <laughs> it's like, a samurai made out of steel, duh! So he's the most popular TV hero for young people! Young? Like, how young? Three, but who's counting? <laughs> um, ten years old? Then <laughs> what the heck are you doing getting all excited? Hey! I'm like 17. That's 17. See? I'm a teen. I like you, Nick. Hey! Don't talk to me like I'm your grandpa or something. I'm only 24 myself. Then watch it with me. He's really cool. And ellipses is really popular. So it really is just Power Rangers. <laughs> but with one person, yeah. <laughs> but I was just making a weird joke, but okay. When they asked grade school kids if they wanted to be, Steel Samurai was number one. I really worry about kids these days. Great amps. Well, Steel Samurai's over. It's time to close up the office. She is definitely not acting 17 right now. No. <laughs> yes. I might want to take the one out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Time. Wish we had some clients. You haven't had a client in a month? That's how long it's been since Turned by Sisters. Matt, a month has passed since my trial. <laughs> Mia's murder was the talk of the town for some time. But no one paid any attention to the right and co law offices. How am I gonna pay the rent this month? It'll be okay. My controller unplugged. I'm sure some big client is just around the corner. <laughs> I'm sure she does that every day. They're right there! Don't worry, October 16th, 8 14 a.m. Phoenix Wright's bedroom. Bring, bring. Hey. <laughs> Hello, this is Phoenix. Nick, Nick, Nick! Maya? What? It's still early. It, it's the Steel Samurai! Steel Samurai got dead. Huh? You mean the guy on that show? Yes! They're saying Steel Samurai killed a villain! Ellipses. <laughs> um. Isn't that what he's supposed to do? <laughs> yeah, on TV. Yeah, on TV. No, I mean, he actually did it in real life. He skewed a villain with samurai spear. I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> this definitely sounds like someone that woke up at 2 in the morning. <laughs> Just come to the office quick, please, Nick. Why is Maya still awake? Excellent question, October 16th, 
9.22 a.m. Right on code law offices. Yeah, you weren't quick to the office at all. <laughs> Maya's here, watching television. Now for the morning news. The actor Will Powers was arrested yesterday. Powers plays the lead role. Will Powers? Really? <laughs> I love this series. Steel <laughs> <laughs> Samurai, lawyer of Neo O Tokyo. He was arrested on the suspicion of murder! Why is there so much murder going on in this place? The victim with Jack Hammer. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Who plays the villain known as the evil magistrate? His body was out, still inside the evil magistrate costume. The samurai spear was also stuck through the body. Police believe this was the murder weapon. <laughs> Investigating further. Ellipses. You know, this, this just sounds like... You know how on the set of The Crow, how, like, Bruce Lee's son died on accident because they screwed up? It just sounds like this accidentally happened. <laughs> this has to be a joke. No, 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 no. It's still over. Bring, bring. Beep. Yes, ring kill law offices. Why are you using your You're cell using phone for your this? Cell phone. Like, what, you have a, an office phone. Exactly. Ellipses? The music stopped. What? Nick? It, it's the Steel Samurai. B what? Yes, yes, of course. We'll be right there. I like how she doesn't even call him by his name. It's just <laughs> the Steel Samurai. We already know his name from that uh, news report. It's Will Powers. <laughs> Uh, uh, let's go, Nick. Go? Go where? Let the Steel Samurai down detention. Oh, uh, back to the detention center. So what? So, I've decided this will be our first case. No, no you would think that he would be spending a lot more time actually at the detention center just looking for potential clients. Did you ever do What about this? <laughs> what about this? You like shut that off, don't you, Nick? <laughs> yes, I do! <laughs> You go. Thank you for acknowledging it. <laughs> All right, let's take a look out the windows. It's a nice day outside. The hotel across the way is always full these days. There's the bellboy happily cleaning the room, of course. Of course he is. Course he is. All right, let me read about this amazing plant. Mia's favorite potted plant. Maya has been watering it so much lately; it looks a little swollen. She's either trying to make it grow, or she's Perfecting her water torture technique. That's uh, kind of, one of those. It's a little scary. A poster of an old movie that Mia liked. I was thinking I should go see it myself. Then I realized the poster doesn't actually say the title of the movie. <laughs> oh, Great, well, um, lovely. Yeah. There's a horrendous amount of legal books here. Scarier still, the thought I have to read all these now. <laughs> oh, no. Mia's desk. Actually, it's my desk now. Sitting here always makes me feel like a professional. Yeah, it's the only time you're ever going to feel like a professional, bud. <laughs> Seriously? Anything else? Doesn't seem like it. Yeah. Do I have the Steel Samurai in the profiles yet? No. I don't. Uh, no. I have Miles, Edgeworth, it's and... The, the three main characters. So yeah, these, they're going to be reoccurring is what you're telling me. Okay. Yeah. There's a reason why I intentionally tortured myself to turn my sisters by giving myself all three of the main characters. <laughs> Yeah, but I ended up being more tortured. <laughs> In that case, yes. <laughs> the long run, no. Well, let's ask her what to do. Well, what should we do? What should we do? How do you sit there like that? You have to go get down to the detention center and meet the Steel Samurai. Call him by his name. He doesn't have another name. Does she want to investigate this case or does, or just do some sightseeing, I wonder? The money's on sightseeing. Any ideas? You don't have enough information to make a case yet. Maybe go to Freeman Brothers. You have lights back in your bathroom. Okie dokie. And the uh, hooks are oh, back up. Let there be lights! Sorry. We, we just got our uh, stuff done in the bathroom, so. Anyways, just admit it. You don't have a clue what happened. No! We just don't have enough information. That's kind of the same thing. Yeah, pretty much. I would show you my attorney's badge, but you thankfully commented on it. 
Well done. Very well done, by the way. <laughs> to the detention center we go. October 16th. Detention center. Visitor's room. God, that's I him? You. <laughs> Ellipses? It's alright, I got the best voice for him. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's that's the voice of him. I, I, ignore my dogs. What's what's wrong, Maya? It's him in the flesh. Um, is that guy really him? What do you mean that guy? Of course it's him. Will Powers, our client. That's him. <laughs> Um, maybe I shouldn't be saying this, Ellipses, but he's definitely did it. M murder! At least once. Maybe twice. Oh my god. Whoa, 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 what are you saying? <laughs> Alright, here we go. You ready for this? Absolutely. <clears throat> um... Y yes? Is something wrong? No, no. This is getting off to a great start. I know, I know, you're disappointed, aren't you? I can't tell what kind of voice you're trying to put on. <laughs> disappointed, oh no, oh no. No, it's okay, this is this is the real me. Oh yeah, now I definitely hear a just California surfer dude. <laughs> yeah, look, that's what I get out of him. <laughs> I just see, like, uh, Mace Tony version of Wolverine. <laughs> I do, too, because he has all the hair and everything. Yeah. <laughs> when I got the part of the Steel Samurai with that mask, I decided I would never show my face in public until the job was over. It's the kids, you know. I don't want to wreck their dreams. Uh, uh, oh. I mean, he looks like a handsome... He's like he's literally like Hugh Jan Jackman. He's, ha he's handsome <laughs> Wolverine. Seriously. <laughs> I guess it didn't matter. <laughs> so much for my dreams. I wonder what they think of the Steel Samurai now. <laughs> yeah, so we go with that Hugh Jackman comparison. <laughs> now, nah, now, nah, not. Nah. Uh, Nick. What? Uh, uh, he's a good guy. I mean, he's good. Yeah. Uh, he didn't do it. Definitely no. <laughs> Oh, All right, time to examine the guard again. Is it any different? This guard monitors the visitor room. He seems frozen in awe of willpower. God damn it! <laughs> well, it's a little different, at least. They, I'm glad they threw in the little pun there. Smile for the camera. That's still the same, though. I love this series so much. It only gets better from here. It's like I said, showed you that one name from one of the later games. It's yeah, like, dear Lord. Is that the trilogy? No, it's not. <laughs> it's my attorney's badge! <laughs> um, here. Oh, we first a picture of it. I, I see. Ellipses. <laughs> Let me guess, this guy wasn't the top student in improv class. That's mean! Let's talk to him. Yeah. We have to. What happened? Sure. Maybe you could start by telling us what happened. It, yes, of course. It seems like it was only yesterday. Actually, it was only yesterday. It's kind of crazy. The wow. cast had come down to Global Studios for a run through. We went through a wow. few action Global. sequences at 10 in the morning. There was That's a rehearsal scheduled for 5 o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> But when five o'clock came around, the staff gathered at the studio. The evil magistrate was found lying in a crumpled heap near the set, bro. What is that? <laughs> is that the hole from his being him being stabbed? I think so. <laughs> I don't oh. think that's supposed to be there. <laughs> they took off his mask and discovered it was Jackhammer, dead. He had been expertly skewered with the samurai spear. The samurai spear? Yes, it's a long spear that I 
that the steel samurai uses as a weapon. Don't you watch my show, bro? Uh, no, he's old and grandpa. The steel samurai. Maybe you can explain to me just what the steel samurai is. Nick, how could you say such a thing? I just explained to you if it's... <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, sir. I apologize for my partner. He's new to this. And a bit out of touch with the world. Hey! Who's new to this? No, it's alright, really, because, like, I don't even know what it is myself. Also, I have a, a handkerchief, I think that was. Uh, the Steel Samurai is the lead character in a popular kids show. He walks the streets of Neo Old Tokyo, fighting battle after battle against the evil magistrate and his minions. <laughs> of course, he never really defeats the evil magistrate. Uh, uh, although, <laughs> I guess he did defeat him this time. Wait, you just admitted you killed him. So, <laughs> though. <laughs> I, I guess all he really admitted to is uh, still Samurai killed the evil magistrate. True. Doesn't necessarily mean that Will Powers killed Jack Hammer. True. Neo Old Tokyo, who comes up with these names? Wow, he really is the definition of a boomer. Powers' is alibi. Now, where were you on the day of the murder? Well, like, that morning I came to the studio at 9am or 9 o'clock. I don't know if it was in the morning or the, the night, you know. We worked through some action scenes until noon. Those are real swords, by the way. Oh yeah, I'll bet. <laughs> Rehearsal like that real with... Sword edge that's broken. You can see it through the text box. <laughs> Shh. Oh, don't, don't tell him. Shh. The spear edge that's broken. It's not a sword head. Idiot. Rehearsal was to begin at 5 o'clock, but I was a little tired. So, after lunch, I took a nap in my dressing room. When I woke up, it was 5 o'clock! I was late for the rehearsal! I hurried to the studio and found everyone looking shocked. They arrested me on the spot and brought me here. So he was sleeping the entire afternoon of the murder? Some action hero. That's like the worst alibi you could have because I was asleep the entire yeah, I was time. Asleep. <laughs> like, unless you can actively prove that you were sleeping. Yeah, like if you had like a roommate or something that could be like, yeah, they were literally here asleep. That's like a terrible alibi. So I mean, I guess they were at the office. It's better to sleep at an office as an alibi than sleeping, let's say, in your apartment. Yeah, they could have they cameras in there. Yeah. I think, oh, I think I should probably check out the scene of the murder. I almost did uh, Will Powers' voice. Right, Global Studios. I'll draw you a map, man. Wow, Nick, let's go. I'm, I'm willing to bet ten bucks he's asked for autographs. He's probably going to ask for his autograph once he's out of the detention center. Mm -hmm. If only I could show you my attorney's badge again. Just double last. check to make sure there's nothing else special. Nothing um, maybe, probably not. Yeah. Seems to be pretty <clears throat> self explanatory. Alright, let's, All right, let's go, go to the studio, studio main, main gate. gate. October by 16th, Global Studios main gate. Wow, so this is where they make the Steel Samurai show. Awesome! Aren't you excited? Oh, this is you too. Have fun. <laughs> hey, oh, hey, you there! <laughs> You want in? You gotta go through me! Uh, oh, sorry. We're, uh, lawyers. Oh, yeah? Well, that's great. I'm security. It's my job to make sure that gawkers like you stay out. G gawkers? Gawkers, sightseers, tourists. I know the type. You heard about the incident and came to snoop around. Yes. Youth today. Something about like uh, jobs. Why? Well, I, I, maybe you should become a lawyer. Like a life uh, was young. Thing different. My friends are happy clothes. What are you using? You start to call it. Nick. Would I grow up to be like her? Please say no. I don't know. It's possible. Hey. Listen when you're being spoken to, youth, these days. 
for use today, whatever. Uh, check out my attorney's badge. <laughs> Actually, I might need to do that, so let me examine first. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it, it might be, like, the one-off time I need to actually do it. Looks like a studio van. They probably use it to carry around film equipment. How do you like my old bag voice? It was really good. Thank and you. yes, her name is Old Bag. The, the, if you've actually looked through the character voices tab I have for this case, every name is up on it. It's oh great. God. The main entrance to the studio, there was a big scene here yesterday with onlookers pressing up against the gate. Is she in my... Oh, okay, it's yeah. just security lady right now. Security lady here, even though we already know it's old bag from the text box. I mean, that could just be her, uh, you know, special name, you know? Because she's an old person. <clears throat> an overhead map of the studios. Nah, it looks kind of empty. Right from here <clears throat> is the employee area. To the left are the actual film studios. The computer that runs the studio security cameras. Hey! No touching! That was a terrifying face, might I add. Yes, yes it is. The security guard station. That security lady must like junk food. There's a mountain of it on the desk there, in there. I can see the computer that runs the security cameras. Let me just uh, take a, a a gander, you know. Uh, of it's horror for science. Anything for else? For science! Probably not. Can't investigate this tree, unfortunately. What about this just footpath? No. Nope. Uh, lo looks like, looks like there's nothing left. Now I'll show you my attorney's badge. What's that? You giving that to me? <laughs> Absolutely not, aw. Uh, I kind of like the idea of Old Bag Ace Attorney, though. The studios. So, what do you do here at the studios? At Global Studios, we make children's dreams come true. In fact, in my younger days. <laughs> no, you were a star? Only a little twinkle between the stars here, I'm afraid, dearie. Well, wow! This place has really gone downhill, you know. But ten years ago, now that was a studio of dreams! Hammer was a big star back then, too. He was... Hammer? <laughs> the victim, dummy! The evil magistrate! He's been reduced to playing villains now. Not exactly the best material to work with, but he's been reduced to death now! You know? Yeah, you can definitely tell that was written back in 2001. Mm -hmm. Nowadays in 2020, villain roles are great. Oh, absolutely. <clears throat> can you tell me about Mr. Will Powers? <clears throat> he's not a bad kid, but don't be fooled by his mask. You wouldn't want him on the silver screen without it, believe me. Little old ladies watching would lose their lunch. That's probably why he thought the Steel Samurai was his big chance. No one thought he was capable of doing what he did to poor Jackhammer. We don't know for certain that Will Powers is guilty, though. Powers? Of course he's guilty. How do I know? I know everything. It's my job. I mean, technically it is. You are the security guard. Yes. He's not wrong. Mr. Hammer. What kind of person was Jackhammer? What kind of person? Oh, if only you knew. Jackhammer will live on in many hearts as the ultimate action hero. He was simply dashing in the Dynamite Samurai okay. series. I think it looks like such a stoner face. <laughs> it really does. His eyes are like weirdly far apart. Mm -hmm. Should I have heard that? Heard of that? <laughs> But there was an accident during filming five years ago. He got an unlucky break after that, reduced to playing the villain on a children's program. What's more, I heard they were paying him peanuts. It's enough to make you cry. <clears throat> Reason for suspicion. Why are you so certain Mr. Powers is the killer? I was standing right here yesterday. I was, as it is my job. I was here from 1 in the afternoon to 5 when they found the body. Now the studio where the murder took place is to the left here. So if you want to go to the studio, you have to pass by me. Only one person went by there between 1 and 2.30 when the murder took place. And that person was Mr. Powers? Yes, I saw him! He was sleepwalking! <laughs> Sleep kill. Mr. Powers says yeah. he was sleeping in his dressing room. 
Oh, I'm sure he would say that. He's no fool. I, I don't know about that one. <laughs> but he was the only one that walked by. He's the killer. You can bet your biscuits on it. Isn't it about time for you to be heading home? There's nothing to see here. Move along. Um, actually, we're here at Mr. Power's request. <laughs> I thought you were suspicious looking. Show me a letter of request. And maybe I'll just let you in. Uh, this lady here seems to think she owns this place, obviously. I mean, I think she's doing her job pretty good. Yeah, but that's actually her job. She, She's not even saying that you can't go in. She's like, if you want to go in saying that you're his lawyer, then prove it. Yeah, exactly. She's a security guard after all. You can't just let everyone in. Alright, so okay. I guess you go back to the detention center and get that request letter. Yep. Hello? How is the studio? They all think I did it, don't they? No, no, not at all. Isn't that right, Nick? Right, not at all. At your worst, you're a suspect. Or at worst, rather. <laughs> Anything new to examine? Probably not. Well, not about it. Same day. It's just instinct for me to check. Well, the dude things talk about. Uh, well, we'll go with the alibi again first, because it's new. Now, Mr. Powers, you aren't hiding anything from me, are you? <laughs> what? No, i never do that. Earlier you said that you were sleeping in your dressing room after lunch. Yes, like a baby, because I'm a baby. Whoa! <clears throat> but the security lady says she saw you that day. She says she saw you heading towards the scene of the crime. Wh what? That's not possible. I was asleep. I really don't know what to say. I was sleeping, I promise. Mr. Powers, if you want me to help you, you have to tell me the truth. I'm new to this lawyer business and I need every advantage I can get. Well, you probably shouldn't say that to somebody you want to help. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> but I swear to you on my mama's grave, I was sleepy. It made the security lady only thought she saw me. What did she see? He doesn't seem to be lying. Okay, so speaking of that security lady... If I had to guess, it was probably somebody in it, the samurai suit, so... Because of, you know, mask and everything? Yeah. Um, about the security guard at the main gate of, to the studio. Oh, the security lady? She's terrible! She called me suspicious looking! <laughs> yes. Actually, she said the same thing to me before. Take off that mask, were her words, I believe. She sucks up to all the bigwigs at the studio, like you probably should. But let her see you stumble once and she'll never let up on you. She's got some nerve. I mean, she's an old lady. What do you expect, guys? Come on. Give her, give her a break. You saw her ramble earlier and <laughs> you were definitely struggling to keep up. <laughs> Do you think you could write up a letter formally requesting my representation? <laughs> of course, man. Powers request. Document proving Will Powers' uh, request for an attorney. It's so weird saying like their names when it's like Will Powers, because it doesn't seem like I'm saying a name. <laughs> I just hope that this will get me past the security lady. Anything new? I'm going to show him what he gave me. Thank you for the letter of request. Show that to the security lady and she'll let you in. Okay. I mean, boring, but something. I'll get as All much right, fluff. Anyway, uh, I think this is around the halfway point of the, uh, the investigation, so we should probably wrap it up around here. Sure. Uh, relatively short part, but I'll survive. We'll survive. <laughs> yeah, short parts aren't necessarily a bad thing. Yeah, so in the next part, we'll uh, finish up the investigation. I assume this will be part one investigation, so I'll save it right yeah. here. Um, so see you guys then. Uh, Goodbye, chicken, tenders. Just chicken tenders, chicken tenders, chicken tenders.